<sighs> I'm not even bothering. I don't want to get killed. that all about? Oh, this is totally gonna get me killed. Soccer more events. Still fighting the Contessa. Contessa. Oh, how many times must you say that? It's not going to happen. I'm dead serious. I'll get you. I'll get you. I'll get you. I mean it. I'll get you. Yes, yes, so I've heard. <sighs> That's one down, two to go. I had better not take any damage while carrying this battery to the other terminal. It is, after all, filled with acid. Okay, ready for another session of Hacking Mastery? It's kind of hard, but you know. We're good.
Why fight it? Don't you want to be my friend? No, you horrible eight-legged cow. No. That old computer powered up. My work here is done. <laughs> It's time to wage war on the castle, and in the confusion, pull off a heist I've named Operation High Road. First, Murray will take down the spotlights on the main gate with the codes provided by General Clawfoot. Then, with the help of the voice modulator, I'll order Neela's forces to attack. Sly will then paraglide the two of us over to the Contessa's getaway blimp, and we'll use it to get inside her re-education tower. The assault on the castle will undoubtedly draw the shadow guards off their post, and if we free Inspector Fox, she's sure to clear out the Contessa. With the mind shuffler exposed, I'll plant the bad mojo bomb, and presto, the clockwork eyes are ours. So if the two of you are ready, let's take our positions and get this thing started.
That should do it. Aha. I've isolated the brain pattern. You and I are about to become the best of friends. Okay, new best friend. Hands up. And I mean all of them. My dear, you really should... Oh. <gasps> go! Shadow go! Come back here, you witch! That Carmelita, always trying to resolve her problems with a shock pistol. She is rather truculent. Stand clear, Sly. This might have a larger blast than anticipated. Bentley, you okay? This is no place for an asthmatic. But I've located one of the clockwork eyes. Can you find the other? No worries, chaps. It's safely in hand. Mila? Thanks for clearing out the Contessa. Nothing I did could pry her away from the clockwork eyes. Hmm, wouldn't she be enough for the old bird? Ta-ta! Bentley, take the eye and escape on the blimp. I'm going after Neela. But the plan! It, this wasn't in the plan! should watch where you're going. This place is dangerous. Don't you dare! That eye is mine! It's mine! Ah, actually, Mr. Cooper, the eye belongs to me. Come back 
here, Contessa. That getaway blimp won't save you. Percival Hades, Slide, can you read me? A cover leader shot out the guy that was just been playing the blimp to standing out of the side of the unsafe way. I'm going down. 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 That eye belongs to me, and I want it back. No way. You think I'm crazy? Actually, on second thought, don't answer that. I really don't want your professional opinion. Not crazy, just stupid. You're an ignorant child playing dress up in his father's legacy. Oh, I know all about you and the Cooper clan. Then you'll understand why this eye needs to be destroyed. Short sighted fool! I have no interest in your narrow interpretation of morality. I'm above all that. Above good and evil. And you think I'd give the eye to someone that's above morality? Enough talk, insect. It will be just as easy and more fun to pry it from your cold, dead hand. Fuck, dude. I hate spiders. Sorry for you. All your education and you still don't know right from wrong. Huh? Oof! I know enough not to let my guard down around an intellectually superior opponent. No. She got the eye? She's got the eye! How's this thing work? What's this do? And this? Guys, help! Carmelina took the eye, and she's trying to get away in one of the Contessa's tanks. Don't worry about it, little buddy. I won't let her get away. Shoot out her tank to end the path. Keep on yelling at her to stop that tank. Still stuck in her tank. Then come around to pick up Bentley for a quick exit. Do what you can, Sly. We'll all hook up at the rendezvous for extraction. There's nowhere left to run. We both know I can beat you in a fight. So why don't you just hand over the eye? You're right, Kuku. In a battle of strength, you've proven yourself. But with this clockwork eye, I can battle in your mind.
don't get hit by it. Exactly the plan, but the Contessa was beaten, and the clockwork eyes were finally mine. The Contessa was arrested and brought to trial for the crimes she committed while working for him. Their PR damage control went one step further by promoting Mila, the hero of fraud, to the rank of captain. Carmelita, still on the outs with Interpol, had to run with the rest of us. To my surprise and eternal delight, I got to help my favorite policewoman escape from the cops. I tried to put it all out of my mind. This claw business was spiraling out of control, and I knew that my gang was at the center of it. We'd be back in action soon enough, but for now, well, we just laid low for a while. We made our way up to Nineveh Bay Canada, the secret hub of John Bisson's shipping empire. As a young man, he trekked across Canada to strike it rich during the gold rush of 1852. An avid prospector, he took some chances and ended up buried alive in an avalanche. Miraculously, the quick freeze kept him alive, and 120 years later, thanks to global warming, he thawed out. A product of his time, he dreams of taming the wild north, damming every river and chopping down all the trees, with progress delivered at the sharp end of an axe. Shipping spice for the clogging proved a lucrative way to bankroll this one-man war against nature. And yet, I have to feel a little sorry for him. He's just a normal guy from the 1850s. Back in his day, he'd be a hero. But today, he's a villain. Either way, that man's got more than his fair share of the clockwork parts. What a low-tech guy like John Bassan is doing with robot parts is a mystery. I almost don't want to know. But as always, it's only a matter of time before I find out. Jean Bassan took over. This used to be 
a popular destination for rock climbers. Some of their old wall hooks are still around. I'm guessing I just jump and hit the circle button to latch on. That's right. And remember to lean back before you spring off the hook. You'll get more altitude. Thanks for the tip. I'll give it a try.
should be able to isolate and track the Iron Horse trains through that satellite dish. Top of the mountain, huh? Shouldn't take long.
How the fuck I'm gonna get to Mario? Safe house. 
fuck, dude, this is not gonna be going well. <sighs> Bear traps. Thank you. 